Well, we think it does make good business sense despite the fact that it is a cost to the city and obviously a significant one, but we see this as an opportunity, a once in a lifetime opportunity uh, for the city to do something that would uh, fundamentally change uh, the way that transportation occurs within Saskatoon, which would have a, a direct benefit to uh, residents as well as businesses within the city. But, uh, the rail does go through, obviously, as we've heard, 6.6 .6 times uh, per day. Um, it, it seems to come at the worst possible time, and uh, people are very upset when these sorts of things happen. So we do hear about it probably more so than what you would uh, expect to based on those uh, parameters. Again, time is money, and everyone respects that. And so if there can be an expedited way of uh, uh, not only getting yourself around Saskatoon, but also goods and services being provided, uh, that would be a, a benefit to, to the residents and businesses as well. Th I think that the discussion is great. The, the debate will be lively, I'm certain, because I'm, I'm pretty sure that there are opposing views around the council table that will uh, feel very strongly one way or another. And there'll be those that will be in the middle that will obviously be the ones that will make the ultimate deciding uh, votes. But uh, it'll, it'll be encouraging to see where it goes. And, and uh, as Mr. Magus alluded to, there are a number of questions that need to be answered. And certainly for us as well, uh, if uh, we, we hear things as the, as the discussion and as the uh, study um, uh, moves forward that, that we don't uh, find um, a means that we can actually support what uh, moving forward is at this point, then, then we would uh, take, take a step back and, and question that ourselves.